week after week we've been announcing massive fights. So, Anthony, I put it to you. Who would be the best victory out of Fury beating Klitschko? We know he already has done as well. Khan beating Canelo or Jazza Dickens beating Rogondo? It's that's quite a, hard. That's one. a great question. I think I, I'd have to go for a Khan beating Canelo just because of the, the, the enormity of the fight. Canelo is a handful. He's the WBC middleweight champion. Khan's come up two weights to fight him. It's a massive event. So if Khan pulled off the win, that'd be massive. But also, no, fair play to Jasmine Dickens for taking the fight with Rigon, though. If he got that win, it'd be massive. The only thing stopping that from being a bigger thing for me because there's obviously no belt on the line. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it'll, it, all of them are going to be massive fights, you know. All of them I noticed fights. how you didn't mention Fury Klitschko. Yeah, I think he's already beaten once. I think Klitschko is definitely over the hill now. I think. I was actually talking to a cabbie on the way over here today and we were talking about he's a big boxing fan. He was saying that like about, about the Klitschko era, mm. definitely come to like an abrupt yeah. end when he fought Fury. I think the last great performance we saw from Klitschko was against David Hay. Since then, he's been kind of substandard and I think any half-decent heavyweight who got hold of Klitschko that night was, would have won. And like, luckily for, you know, for a British, British public, it was Fury. So for you, it would be calm beating Canelo. Mm -hmm. Dev, what did the viewers think? <laughs> Well, we're being spoilt right now, aren't we, with all, all these big fights, UK fighters involved. And uh, any one of those wins would be a big statement on the world stage. The Betting HQ reckons Dickens beating Riggan, though, would be one of the all-time upsets in the sport. That's echoed by Kabir. Dickens beating Rigo would be the biggest shock of the three. Rigo is amongst the pound for pound in the world, and Jazza isn't in the top three in the UK. Uh, Stephen Wilkinson, friend of the show, Anthony, I'm sure you remember from last oh, week. Steve <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, he's voted Khan, so he's actually he was friends with you here. We got voted Khan. Stevie. Exactly. <laughs> I reckon him beating Canelo <laughs> would be pretty big. Same for Dickens. Fury will beat Vlad again, no problem. Thanks, Stephen. Uh, big shout here from Sayers. For me, beating Vlad twice in a row would be epic. Basically, Fury would prove to the world it wasn't a fluke. He's actually better. Yeah, I agree with that one. Yeah. Declan McCauley, Dickens beating Rigo is the most unlikely, but the one that would have the most impact is Khan beating Canelo. That, that's, that's, oh, that's gosh. We started well this week, Anthony. Agreeing People are ag agreeing with you. Wow. Wow. Well, I'm getting <laughs> slagged off. This is a, it's a new day. Sorry, Dave. We interrupted your one? corner then. Carry what on. about this one? Kevin Bowen, he's thinking completely differently. He thinks, depends what you mean by the biggest. Surely, retaining the World Heavyweight Championship is the biggest prize in the sport. I like that. So we've done a poll. Out in front, 43% of the votes. Khan beating Canelo. No one saw this fight coming. And what an achievement it will be if Amir Khan is to become the lineal middleweight champion of the world.